Well, I personally saw this movie as an opportunity, a grand opportunity to ruin the minds of today's youth with senseless random insanity while earning a huge profit. No, we did it for free, remember? Oh, yeah. That makes me sad. No, I wanted the double wide trailer with the master bedroom and the hot tub slash jacuzzi room. H wait, hold on a second. Turn that camera off! Well, to me, the movie was a nice refreshing escape from the old homestead. Sometimes, it's good to get away from these four walls, made of cardboard. But now that it's over, I'm right back begging on the streets. Look me up sometime if you're ever on the wrong side of the tracks, and bring food. Nader can only live so long off of whatever the heck that crusty stuff growing in the corner is. Can we get a shot of the crusty stuff? Zoom in on the crap. Uh... Movie? What movie? Well, you know how it is. His people contacted my people, and one thing led to another and- No, actually I was just walking by, saw the camera, couldn't help myself. I really had no idea they were filming a movie or anything. Kind of embarrassing, really. You think they'll contact me for the sequel? A Rolling Tale the movie? Ah, good times. Good times. My role in a Rolling Tale? Heh. <laughs> you could hardly call it a role. I was more of an extra. Or a prop. They promised me a better part next time. Mentioned something about a steel cage and a wheelchair. What am I, a paralyzed cage match pro wrestler or something? For the sequel, I hear they're bringing in some sort of stunt specialist. <laughs> That was good. We'll call you. We can't tell you much about the sequel. Can't tell you anything. That too. But it's gonna be good. It's gonna be real good. Yeah. Maybe. The sequel? Yeah, it's gonna be stupid.